Hello friends and welcome back to our Daily Women's Devotional, I Am Love, edited by Carolyn Rathbunson. Today is September 9th and the title of our devotional is Autumn Leaves, written by Angel Peterson. A Bible verse is found in Genesis chapter 8, verse 22. While the earth remaineth seed time and harvest and cold and heat and summer and winter and day and night shall not cease. Angel writes, My mom passed away almost three years ago while still living in the house my sister and I grew up in. Dealing with fallen autumn leaves in the yard became a huge task. When mom was alive, she didn't like being the only house in her cul-de-sac with a leaf blanketed lawn. The days of children coming around asking to rake leaves for money are long gone. Nobody wants to rake leaves. I couldn't find a reliable person who would do that task from year to year. After her death, I wanted to honor my mom by making sure the lawn was raked. When my mom died, we notified the neighbors so that they could alert us if they noticed anything going on at the house. That autumn, I tried to line up someone to rake the leaves. One day, only a few months after losing mom, I received a call that went to voicemail from the neighbor next door to my mom's house. He, a pastor, said, I know you're probably still mourning, but could you please get the leaves up as they are blowing in everyone else's yard? That hurt. I thought his call was rude, inconsiderate, and lacked any form of compassion. I did eventually get the yard cleaned up, but every year since then, I start stressing each September when trying to line up someone to rake all those leaves. Did I mention it's a ton of leaves? In fact, it's become my yearly joke that when I get to heaven, I will ask the Lord, what lesson were you teaching me through all these leaves? I didn't want to receive another call from the neighbor because I wanted to remain Christ-like in my dealings with him, though there have been other situations concerning this neighbor that have risen since my mom passed. This past year, after making several calls and praying that the Lord would please help me find someone, I did. But they never showed up. Lord, you know how this stresses me each year. Why can't I find anyone to do the job? What's the lesson? Please help me see it. I distinctly heard my father's voice say, What makes you think it's a lesson I'm teaching you? The lesson is for him, the neighbor. Wow. I have always told the Lord to use me. I never pictured it in that way. I pray that the neighbor was open and willing to learn his lesson. Maybe patience? I'm looking forward to a stress-free autumn this year. Angel Peterson lives in Ohio, United States of America, and enjoys taking everyday occurrences and relating them to her spiritual life. She is eagerly, patiently, and faithfully awaiting Christ's soon return and proclaims the promise of Hebrews chapter 10, verse 37. You know, to be honest, I never really thought about it that way. Sometimes God allows things to happen so that we can be a testimony and we can show Christ-like behavior to others. And sometimes the lesson may not even be for us. So the next time we're going through a rough situation that maybe we're a little bit uncomfortable with, ask God to help you through it and ask him to see what his purpose is. It may be for your neighbor and not yourself. I hope that you're blessed. You enjoyed today's devotional and I will see you again tomorrow.